Hey guys, it's Matt, welcome to Speed Tutor, and we're going to be talking about making GIFs out of your gameplay, whether you're a game developer, or you could do this for any promotional work that you have, whether that be across games, multimedia, or so much more. So in the background, I have one of my trailers that I've released recently, and maybe I want to take a little bit of this and make it into a GIF. Now, how would I go about doing it? If you want to capture some of the gameplay, you can use OBS or maybe Shadow Play if you've got an NVIDIA GPU or something within your game engine or however else you've got footage. And I'm going to use this in Premiere and then we're going to look at translating that to a GIF and being able to use it on social media. And be sure to throw a like on this video because it would really, really help me out. So I'm going to be using Premiere, like I said here. Now you can use any sort of software because we're just going to need to render this out in a default 1080p template or however you want the size to be. Now you can see my sequence settings from Premiere is it's 30 FPS, 1920 by 1080 square pixels and everything basic as you can see here. And I've just got a default scene and I've got my trailer which I want to throw on my timeline. Sometimes it might ask that the clip doesn't match the sequence settings so I can just keep the existing settings because some of this footage might be 60 FPS but it doesn't matter for now. When you've got a GIF it's probably good to have your GIF anywhere between 5 and 15 seconds really because you've, you've got limited time to entice people to come and have a look at your work that you've got going on. So maybe when I'm scrubbing through my footage here I want the GIF to be looking up at this large rock here before I cut the scene from my trailer. So if I go to pretty much the start of that, I'm just going to press C to cut and then we're going to move and scrub to the end of it or whatever or wherever you want your footage to be. So I'll cut to the end of there. I'm just going to remove the other clips that I've got and I'm just going to drag this or ripple delete so it'll hit it at the beginning. I'll drag my bounding area so I can see that it's around three seconds long by looking at my footage length. So as you can see, I can play it like this. What we want to do is we want to go to File, Export Media, if you're using Premiere, like I say, or you want to export it. I usually use H.264. I use a custom preset, which is just 1080p, and the frame rate can be 60 FPS if you want to keep it like that, if you want it to be slightly speedier, but you can have this at 30 and then I'm going to choose where to save it and I'm just going to click export and you can see my gif like so This is just the render of the video that I've got which I've just rendered out to put, create in gif format Now we're going to go to a website called Giphy and Giphy allows you to take any footage be able to convert it into a gif for you and it'll crop it down, size it down and make it very small and make it really easy to use So what you can do is if you make an account it's free for anybody and you can keep all your stuff private if you don't want to share it or you can share it with the community. You can press upload at the top and then it'll ask you that you need to upload an mp4, a gif or a .mov. And I'm going to choose my gif that I've just uploaded and you can choose to trim it down if you don't have something that you like. But I like it just like that. I can continue to upload. I'm just going to put this as private because I don't need anybody else to see it. And then when I click upload, it will upload to my account. And once you've then uploaded, it will bring up a screen showing that it's all there. And this is my current GIF, as you can see. Now I can press the share button and I can choose where to share it, whether I want a social media link, the original file, or an MP4. So I can just press social and I can just then press the X on my footage here. I can right click, save image as. I'm going to choose to save it to my desktop and it will download it. It's called giphy.gif. And here you can see that I've just opened it on my desktop and it was four megabytes in size because you can see the file information, 4.9 megabytes by 480 by 270. And you can see that it's a GIF that rotates over and over and over. You can use this on social media, put this wherever you want. And it'll just be a quick and easy way to make yourself a GIF without you having to worry about cropping it down yourself. I hope this is a tutorial which helps you out and makes your GIFs quicker and easier to create. So thank you so much for watching. Come and support me on Patreon if you like the content that I create because it would really help me out and you can get access to scripts, projects and so much more. Come and join me on Discord if you want to chat. Be sure to come and check out my awesome assets on the Unity Store and thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.